L.A. was the mural capital of the world, but it's been bludgeoned by graffiti, censored by the city. That's how they want to bury the past here. Oh, what the hell is going on here? You know, this is shit. Yeah, the city gives you uh, your 60 days notice. You have to do something with the mural document or it's going to be covered up. Now, I've been painting murals, uh, it'll be going on 40 years, that's four decades. And uh, the reason why I love to paint murals is because I love the myriad of people who live around my art. And I think murals bring people together, you know. We can bring art to the level that the people deserve. They call me the gang turf guy. But these places are more than that. They're vibrant, living. This is where mural art is at its best. Museums are for the dead, you know. I want life. <laughs> Graffiti can only be embraced by their own, right? These tigers, they're just into self-promotion. Sooner or later, the, the paths are going to cross. It's an art form, either way. You're putting your name on their fame, basically, you know? If they go right on a mural, there's a possibility that if their, their tag or their throw up, whatever they're doing on that mural, is going to have longevity versus writing on a clear wall or something, because eventually they're going to come in and erase that real quick. So this piece was whitewashed and destroyed because the CRA, California Redevelopment Agency, wanted to uh, stimulate the commerce in this area and get rid of the presence of the culture here because it was degrading. There's no graffiti on it, it's pristine. They whitewashed it so they can infiltrate and, and change the whole complexion and gentrify this area and uh, make it what it is right now. All these works are gone. Ghost of the Barrio. Harmony. That's what this uh, mural symbolizes, harmony. It only reflects the vibrancy of this community, the spirit and the soul of this community. We all need to support each other. I mean, it's bad enough we have all the negativity as, as, as it's out there as it is, you know. I accept any, any kind of art form. As long as you're willing to work with me, I'm willing to work with you. As street artists, we all need to coexist to respect each other. I hope one day our two styles can work together and connect. You gotta connect. If I don't connect, I might as well just dissolve and fade away.